Hello my mermaids and welcome back to the channel. Today we have Lair Hair. I am so excited with this unit. You guys was amazing. This is a deep wave 28 inch. You guys, all I did was bleach the knots. Um and I plugged the I plugged the knots and I did bleach it. I bleached and plugged the knots, you guys. Very simple, very easy. Um here is the construction of the wig, you guys. You have the three combs and you have a elastic band and you know you're gonna also get your wig cap you're gonna get your little brush and you're gonna be good to go so i have the wig placed upon my head and now i'm just going to show you what it looks like um while i adjust it this is the first thing i normally always do is i place it on my head i adjust it i check the hairline i like to see what it's looking like and see how far i need to pull it down or how far i need to pull it back so this helps a lot The hairline is perfect. You guys, please excuse my voice. It's just, I need, I need some tea or something. It's very early. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take my even spray. This is the black even spray. And I'm gonna apply this to the perimeter of my hairline. And this is where the lace is going to lay. I'm using three coats of this. I'm spraying one coat, I'm letting it dry, spray another coat, let it dry, and then spray another coat, and then you can apply it. I let that dry, you let it get tacky. Once it gets tacky, I go ahead and I bring the lace down, and I begin to comb it to smooth it inside of the lake of the glue so that it will stick perfectly you guys look at this hairline it looks so good everything is blended so wonderfully now I'm gonna go ahead and put my elastic band on. I'm gonna let this melt, and it's gonna allow the lace to melt into the skin. I usually like to take it off after about 20 minutes, so it's been on for 20 minutes, so now it is melted and it looks perfect, exactly how I want it to look. This was actually really easy to do. Next, I'm gonna take my hot comb and I am going to smooth that all along the hairline just to make it even flatter. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and begin to cut the lace off. This lace was so easy to cut off. I like to use an eyebrow razor um, to give it a flawless uh, finish, and this helps a lot. I was able to cut it off with no problem at all.
Next, I'm gonna go ahead and as I cut the lace off, any areas that I see that is lifting, I'm gonna go ahead and apply the even spray and add my blow dryer if I feel it's necessary. I feel like this is the easiest way to do it, just to spray it section by section and it helps lay it down and it gives you more of a flawless finish versus trying to spray the whole thing. Just do it section by section and you'll be fine. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and blow dry any areas that are wet from when I sprayed to make sure that it is sealed in flawlessly. Next, I'm going to go ahead and do a bust down middle part. Um, as you guys can see, the scalp is flawless and fantastic. Um, I mean, this hair did so well with the bleaching of the knots and just applying it. It just was so easy to apply. So now I'm just going to go ahead and take out my baby hair. I'm going to do just the baby hair in the front and then on the sideburns. And that's all I'm going to do just to keep it simple. So that's what I'm doing here.
but now I'm just here making sure that they're even and that it looks exactly how I want it to look. Now I'm gonna go ahead and just take my hot comb and flatten everything out, making sure that everything is flat, flawless, no humps, no bumps. I definitely want this to be nice and flat. It definitely makes a huge difference when you use a hot comb. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go ahead and add my melting band just so seal it again, seal those baby hairs into place. Now I'm taking my wax stick and I'm gonna go ahead and apply that to where the part is. And this is gonna give it even a more sleek finish. So here we go. Now we're gonna go ahead and get ready to cut these baby hairs off, check everything to make sure that it's nice and flat the way we want it to be, which is looking great. The hair, I'm very pleased and satisfied with the hairline. Um, this is definitely one of my favorite wigs, you guys. I got so many compliments. I wore this wig out one day and I got so many compliments. Everybody, everywhere, thought it was so pretty. It was so lightweight, you guys. You're gonna love this wig if you get it, and I definitely recommend it. So again, we're just going ahead and put more hot comb in the hairline area because we are getting ready to cut that baby hair portion off. I'm just taking an eyebrow razor just to cut it. So the easiest way for me to do my baby hairs, I find, is by spraying the brush with the got to be or the even spray and smoothing it out with the product on the brush and then spraying it on the surface that I need to have the spray on. And so that definitely helps me out a lot. Um, my baby hairs have gotten so much better through time it definitely does take time to get better um, and know what works with you what helps you easier what works best for your hair and your fingers or whatever um, but yeah you'll get the hang of it just keep going keep practicing and keep taking your time um, it takes practice it really really does but I was very pleased and satisfied with the way these baby hairs came out
Next, I'm plucking the middle part area just to give it more definition, to find it more, and also bring out the part a little bit more. I actually like that I did it this way versus the other ways that I've been doing it. And then I applied some concealer straight down and it looked perfect, literally just flawless. So now I'm just adding, literally all I'm adding is water. That is it to this hair. I'm not adding anything else. Um, it doesn't need anything. This hair is perfect, 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 perfect. I love the way it turned out. This is so, so pretty. It's such a beautiful wig. Um, you guys, I'm just, I was so happy with this install. It came out so good. Um, I was on the phone with my friend and he was like, oh my God, that looks so good. <laughs> so yeah, you guys, it is approved by men, women, children. Everybody loves this hair and I think you should definitely get it. You guys check the description box and check the links in the description box if this is something that you're interested in purchasing. I highly, highly, highly recommend it. I have been doing wigs for some time now so I can tell what's good, what's not. This is the wig for you. You definitely need this this wig. It's very lightweight. And if you like long wigs, you will be happy. This wig was 28 inches. And I loved it. Every bit of it. <laughs> I love you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Very simple, very easy install. You can do this. It's not anything that's too hard, too complicated that you can't do. Um, it's, it's laid, honey. It's laid. It's flawless. And it looks absolutely beautiful. Um, and I'm very happy with it. Very, very happy with it. I love it. I was feeling myself at the end. <laughs> um, but it looks so pretty. And I have a clip here at the end. Um, when I did one of my other videos, how the hair just laid like this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you how it looked when it was like completely dry. Um, it looked beautiful. So this is the hair, you guys. I love it. Flowy, movable, it's sitting in place, doing what it need to do. <clears throat> shining and looking good I think this might have been one of my best installs you guys so far the baby hair placement was on point everything about this this unit was on point I absolutely love it look at it you guys it just flows it looks so pretty And this is a clip of the hair when it was dry. Um, look at that curl, you guys. It still had just water in it. It doesn't look dry. It moves with me and it just looks amazing. So I wanted to show you guys that.